Hey guys, so just uh, back again with another video. Uh, Note GT, uh, what do you call it? Samsung Galaxy Note GTN 7000 International. It's rooted. Uh, and just going to show you the ROM I'm running now. I actually like it. It's very quick. Uh, stock is very quick without overclocking it. Um, so it, has, it has stock clock rates and very smooth and stable. This one is called the John Rom. I've been running this for a while. So that's the version John Rom version 8. Okay, that's the version I'm running. And I'm pretty sure it comes with uh, the speed mod chip, uh, not chip, uh, speed mod uh, kernel. But I installed the latest one, which is uh, K55 speed mod. You can get both at XDA developers. Um, just search it there, look under the uh, N7000 development, and you'll find it there. If not, you can just Google it. Uh, that's where it's at, XDA developers for both of those, what I'm running. So, runs very smooth. Uh, you have your toggles up there, notifications to pop up. Very nice. This is a uh, Go Launcher EX. Everybody knows watch who watches my video. That is what I run because I like the transitions that it comes with. Um, here, mm, Gmail. All right, everything runs smooth. What else? Make sure the pen hover, all that works. Now, if you overclock, I find that it, uh, what do you call it, the, the, the native uh, video app doesn't work. All right, so that works. Let's see if this, no, that won't, usually won't start playing. Let's see what happens. If I go over there, I think this will start up. No. Okay, so let's try going to the native app. And most likely that won't work either. Because I, ha I do, I'm pretty sure I have it overclocked. Oh, okay. So it's not overclocked, so let's try the, the stock. Here, video player. See if that works. Yep. So that works. Okay. So now let's, what, let's see what happens. Like I said, this is stock clock rates. Um, this is Tegrac overclock because overclock is not native to the kernel that's installed. You can also get this at the App Store. Uh, sorry, at the uh, marketplace. Right, so basically, let's load the module, get a vibration CPU. Let's set that to the max, which is it'll let you to go to 1.6. Right, um, set CPU. I use this, you don't have to, but I do. Uh, I set profiles, I set the chips to uh, performance and deadline for the I think that's the scheduler. Profiles, I set it up for when the screen turns off on set CPU, everything drops out as 200 megahertz. Then when I fire it back up, I actually have it between 8 and 1600. Um, I'm running my 6500 milliamp battery in this. So it doesn't make it too huge. See, here's the pen. It doesn't make it too huge, but uh, I don't know. I like it. It's not for everybody. People like the uh, the slim profile. Uh, with me, I'll sacrifice aesthetics for uh, for performance and uh, battery life. This ROM v, uh, is very very good on the battery. It's very battery friendly. It's stable. It's fast stock by itself without doing anything to it. Um, Go Launcher EX. Very nice. Right. 
um, here hit this all right let me see so we're gonna select from album instead so we're gonna go here that's the format go back so now it's just gonna sit there and toggle through all right I got the uh, music player that's the stock one right there Um, so now that it's overclocked, actually, let, let's see, uh, sorry, I lost my train of thought there. Let's see if this, uh, if the stock native video player works. Now, with this ROM, it has the S4, Galaxy S4 icons, as you see, the video player icon there. This one, it's, uh, new. So let's click that, most likely it'll, it won't work. Okay, so maybe it does work. Hmm. Okay, so overclock to 1.6, it works. Sometimes it's sketchy. Sometimes it works for me, sometimes it doesn't. Right now it's working, so I guess that's a good thing. So, huh. That's good. So, actually, let me try to see if, the, if we can get that to pop up. Usually it'll force close there. Oh, wow. Okay. It's a good day. Everything is working. So that's that's pretty good actually. That's my daughter singing. So everything runs smooth. Uh, let's see. Let's go here. Click that. This should pop up. Hmm. Now I don't know if it's because it's overclocked. But usually this will pop up. You can click it and that pops up, but usually with the hover it'll work, pen hover. So that's about it. Nothing really majorly new with my uh, phone. Um, I like this ROM. You can get it from XDA developers. Once again, that ROM is John ROM. Okay. John Ron version number eight, and the kernel I'm running is the speed mod uh, K55. That's it. Let me see where I'm at for a video. Eight minutes. So anyway. Hope you liked the video. If you have any questions, send me uh, send me a message. I'll try to get to you as fast as I can. Uh, games run very smooth on this also. Uh, this version, the the kernel, the max set uh, speed for the GPU is 400 megahertz. So most video and games are very very smooth. And then I've got it overclocked to uh, 1.6 gigahertz, as you see there. So. That's it. And running the 6500 milliamp battery, big honking battery. It's nice. I really have no issues and finally found a battery that lasts all all day. There's also a, a battery from Zero Lemon, and uh, if you Google them, they have a well for the Note. They don't make it for the Note One, but for the Note Two, they make one that's 9300 milliamps. It's a, it's a battery that goes right into the slot and it's flush just like stock, but it's actually a little bit thinner than this one, but it takes up, it spreads out from here to here, and this whole back is, is, is taken up with battery, 9,300 milliamps. I emailed them asking them, are you going to be making one for the Note 1? They said no, they had no plans, which is understandable because we're already going to uh, Note 3 pretty soon. So, sucks because I'd love to have a 9300 milliamp battery. If you have a S3, they make a 7000 milliamp battery, same format, zero lemon. Check it out, it's very cool. If you uh, want one battery and let it last, for it'll last you a long time. But for now, 6500 milliamps lasts me a good 10 hours, solid 10 hours. I'm good to go. Pretty good. Hope you liked the video. See ya.